Hi, today we are discussing about XPIC microwaving features and XPD calculation. Here, XPIC means cross polarization interference cancellations. So, basically, in microwave, uh, uh, we, uh, we transmit HTM1 by using horizontal and vertical polarization of a microwave antenna. But in XPIC link, we, trans, uh, we transmit dual HTM1 or two HTM1 by using horizontal and vertical both polarization of, a, of the antenna. So for this, we need a uh, dual polarization antenna. So uh, in this figure, uh, each polarization, vertical and horizontal demodulator, path receive a large signal of the opposite uh, polarization, causing cross polarization interference. XPIC system filter the cross polarization interference signal to receive the desired signal. So in XPIC technology, each polarization path receives both the polar signal and the cross polar signal. So the receiver subtract the cross polar signal from the polar signal and cancel the cross polarization interference. So uh, now, okay, uh, in cross polarization spectrum, we use dual polarization antenna required and the Dual polarization antenna will radiate both horizontal or vertical polarization, but in same frequency, each polarization will carry one separate data stream. It means there are two HTM1, and yeah, the cross polarization generates an intra system interference, and the antenna should be able to cancel out the interference. This capacity of antenna is called cross polarization discrimination (XPD). So now, uh, how we calculate the XPD value for the uh, XPIC link? So here, uh, a diagram is given for the space diversity antenna. So first, uh, our first step is to take all the, all of the antenna and measure the RXL. Then, on the TX for V1 radio, and check the RXL of V1, V2, H1, and H2. Here, V1 and V2 means site A vertical polarization antenna and H1 and H2 for horizontal polarization radio. So, and the same is in the far end. So, when we on the V1 transmitter, we get uh, near about minus 41 RSL at V1 far end, V1 and minus 39.8 far end V2 and same 78 and 65 h1 and h2 so the xpd value is difference between v1 and h1 so it is near about 30 minus 37.5 the same for v2 and h2 it's near about minus 25.4 so we calculate the uh, xpd value for all the, uh, all the um, radio so uh, actually xpic link uh, in XPIC link, XPD value is differ. Basically, it is uh, 25 dBm to 30 dBm, but it depends on the antenna. If the, there is high performance antenna, so XPD value will increase and it will 30 dB to 35 dB. And the same super high performance antenna, it is near about 40 dB. So.